Hello everyone, thank you for joining us today. We're going to talk about Cloud UEBA and showcase some of the functionality of Cypher Cloud UEBA. UEBA stands for User and Entity Behavioral Analysis. Behavioral analysis is the ability to correlate data and provide true output based on the user, data, and then all the trigger, triggers and alarms that that user is creating. Now, sometimes that user or that entity is a device, it's an application, etc. So what we're going to do today is talk a little bit about how you can see all these different anomalies. So Cypher Cloud Dashboard has very detailed visual reports where you can look at what's happening across your network, all the policy analytics, which files have been downloaded the most, what's been encrypted, what's violated policy, who's violated policy. And you can see this across multiple areas, policy analytics, activity monitoring. Uh, you can drill down into these files. You look at the raw events and kind of get a deeper understanding of these events. And again, you can take this information and feed it back into your your favorite sim or uh, your other application so you can do deeper or historical troubleshooting outside of just cloud uh, cloud and CASB. so in this scenario we want to look at which users are doing what in which location and here we can drill down uh, and look at all the violations happening down to the geolocation um, from an encryption activity monitoring privileged user access and this is interesting because uh, you can drill down to the users and see what are the anomalous activities happening by geolocation and there we saw this user actually log in within minutes of each other in two drastically different locations so and they attempted to apply or to download uh, sensitive content. So we can catch that um, and we can drill down and see when and which day this happened. Again, we capture the, the raw detail. Uh, you can look at that user's uh, behavior, uh, where what they're doing over time. And this is a beautiful three-dimensional view of how many triggers or alarms do they have within an hour and how risky are those uh, based on its weighting. And that's pretty much it. So you get a full view of your users, your data, your applications, and this feeds back into DLP, adaptive access control, and other cloud controls. Thank you for watching this demo.